everyone, my name is Tabitha Cutshaw. I know it's been a hot minute since I've been on uh, YouTube and I do apologize for that. I hope my subscribers are uh, not angry at me. <laughs> but you came for the title, right? Uh, the Easter basket. What's in my Easter basket? Well, this year I'm not doing a basket. I'm actually going to put my kids' things in an uh, umbrella. So if you want to see what's in the kids' umbrella, then stay tuned. Okay, so. What I have in my oldest daughter, Lily, uh, she's four. We have the umbrella. It's got um, mermaids all over it. It's freaking adorable. Um, that's kind of what her theme is. It's not all mermaids, but it's a lot of it. So first we'll start with this bag. It's just like this little tote bag. They love carrying things. It says, I'd rather be a mermaid. It's her favorite color too, and it's even got like little colorful strings. She's definitely going to love it. And then we have a hat to kind of go with the bag. It also has a mermaid on it. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it says I'd rather be a mermaid. And then it's got like this little pink underneath. Okay. And then we got this. Here, we'll do this. We got this outfit. It's not her Easter outfit, but I did want some clothes to go with uh, their little umbrella kind of like a spring little outfit and this adorable little piggy i just could not pass up it's just too darn cute so they each got a stuffed animal <laughs> and then it's um a canvas they paint it theirself it's either got like the paint back here and the stickers and i just thought that'd be a fun little thing little activity for the kids and then we got this little grow figure it's a mermaid and it's supposed to grow, it takes 72 hours. <laughs> That's going to be a while. All right. And then we got this Seek and Find book. She's really, really into like books like this. So I thought it'd be fun for her. She's in preschool, so I'm sure she did a lot of that in her class. And then each of my kids got the bunny ears. Um, these are my dogs. Uh, he's going to be in a little Easter photo with us. So... Had to get him a pair and then we got stickers just some regular bunny egg stickers we got some sunglasses and then we got like this little egg and it's got bubbles in it and then we got rain boots because what's an umbrella without rain boots right spring is coming they're gonna need them and then of course to fit the theme i had to get a raincoat the raincoat is going to be really big on her, but I figured as the years grow, she'll grow with it. So that's what I hope. Oh, actually forgot. She has chocolate. That's the only candy that they're going to get from us. And then she's got this little uh, grow kit. So they're going to plant a flower. I just thought that was so cute. Plus it's got one of her favorite colors for the pot. So that's her little basket. I normally wouldn't open an umbrella inside because to me this is bad luck. So let's hope no bad luck comes my way opening uh, two more umbrellas. Alright, let's go on to the next. Okay, so for my son, I actually decided not to open the umbrella again. I just don't need any more bad luck in the house. Uh, so I didn't open it. I'm sorry, but I will show you what it looks like and uh, everything that's going to be in his basket. It's all in this bag. This was like the original plan until I went on Pinterest and then I saw the umbrella and like the rain boots and I was like, forget my idea. This is way cuter. So that's exactly what I did. So let's get started. I guess we'll start with the things that are out of the bag. These are his rain boots. Um, they're just plain black ones. He's not going to care. Plus it does its job, right? It's going to protect him from getting his shoes wet. And then the umbrella. It's got little French Bulldogs on it. I really want a French Bulldog so bad. So uh, this is a start, right, for my son? That's what I say. Okay, so to go into the back. So here's the bag. It says, I'm just here for the snacks, which if you know my son, this is 100% him. He's two years old and he eats like a 40-year-old man. I just, I don't understand where he puts it. Like he just, he just keeps eating and he's like the scrawniest little boy ever. I guess he's just like his mom. I don't know. But yeah, he's tiny. All right, so going with the theme, um, he has this hat. It also says, I'm just here for the snacks. 
It's just a little baseball cap. It's got the little blue stripes. So there's that. I'm just gonna pull out of the bag. He's got this cute little stuffed bunny. I just could not help myself. I really couldn't. So they all have similar things, just different theme. He's got ears as well. Everyone's got the ears, except he has got a little more of a special thing. He's got a bow tie and suspenders because why not? A little boy just needs suspenders and a bow tie. Every time I put him in it, I just think he's absolutely adorable. So if we got a new one, it's going to match his little Easter get up. Also has sunglasses. He also has a grow kit. It's uh, planting poppies. So that'll be fun for them since they're all obsessed with trolls and poppy, you know what I mean? If you have little ones, I'm sure you understand what I'm talking about. Okay, so he also has bubbles, little carrot for his little stuffed bunny. And then he's got stickers, so just the regular little stickers. This also has a grow kit. It's a grow figure. Uh, it doesn't really say how long it takes or how long it gets. I don't know. No idea, but uh, we've had these in the past. Kids love them, so they each got one. He has his own little canvas as well. And again, the stickers in the back, the paint. Uh, it's just like a little under the sea thing. Little sharks kind of fitting the theme as well. This is where we really go off theme. <laughs> so it's got monkeys and we just call him our monkey boy. He's always climbing on something, always wants bananas. He's just our little monkey. Oh, and he's got the cutest big ears. Don't tell him, but I love him. They're just so big. They're adorable. All right, so now for probably the cutest thing in his thing, or his umbrella is his raincoat. How stinking adorable is this? The little hammer, the little saw. It says work zone. It's got a hood. Oh, wrench back here. I mean, he's gonna look so darn cute in this. It's gonna be big on him because he's very small, like I said. <laughs> so kind of be like his sister is just gonna have to grow into his. No big deal. Raincoats, you only need them for a season, right? All right, so he's got a little piece of chocolate, a little Reese's. And then his outfit, grab both of them. Just a little plain shirt and some like colorful shorts. I just thought it was spring. We'll do its little job. It's again, not an Easter outfit. It's just clothing that I put in the bag. And uh, that's all for his. So now we'll get on to the babies. Stay tuned. Okay, so now it's the baby's turn. What's in her little Easter umbrella? So we'll first start out with this bag. Um, it's just a, a purple bag with a star. Nothing too special like the other ones with the same. And uh, we'll go into that in just a minute. Let me show you these cute rain boots. So these took me like a week to find. It's so hard to find rain boots that would be in her size. I didn't think it'd be such a challenge. But I found them at Burlington for only $10, so I scored. And her sister is obsessed with Frozen as well, so she'll probably love them too. I probably wish that she had Frozen in the, or Frozen rain boots. What have you. Alright, so to go into the bag, uh, we have this canvas. Her birthday theme was unicorn, so I thought this was just kind of fitting for her. She's got the stickers again in the back, the paint. So there's that one. She's also got the cute little ears. Uh, the ears will actually match her umbrella. So that's kind of cute. So here's her umbrella. It's just polka dots and it's got the little pink uh, handle. Let's see, it'll just kind of match. I didn't really plan that, but I'm all for it. So there's her umbrella. This is her cute little stuffed animal. She's got the little chick. It's so cute. Okay, she's also got sunglasses. I'm sure they'll fall off her little baby face, <laughs> but I had to get them, had to fit everyone else's. She's got stickers as well. She most likely will not be able to use these either, um, but I'm sure she'll love watching her sister and brother do it. Now, this is where it gets a little different. Uh, the other two had the little pots, but I gave her just a fake flower just because I don't trust her planting. And it's just something that she'll be able to chew on and just whip around whatever she wants to do with it. It was only a dollar, so 
if it like breaks right away or some other kind of nonsense then that's fine <laughs> it's just something for her to chew on okay she's also got a grow thing once this gets bigger it won't be a choking hazard so i'm not concerned about this she's also got a book it's got a little fox on it uh we've always called her little fox this is just when i was pregnant with her i didn't know what gender she was didn't like calling a baby an it it's always been a pet peeve of mine so I uh, named her Little Fox until she was born, and it just kind of fit the theme that's in her bedroom. So got a little fox book. Little backstory for you guys. Okay, she's also got a piece of chocolate. She'll love that. And I couldn't find her uh, a baseball cap, so she's just got this little sun hat, which will be perfect for her for the summertime. Keep the hot sun rays out of her eyes and her face and I couldn't find a raincoat which I'm not done looking yet I'm still on the hunt but for now this will do it's just a little jacket cute little spring color and then her dress is absolutely adorable try to get closer here the little details so cute I just had to grab it I got all their clothes at once upon a child very uh, convenient store for me. And then um, last but not least is just the uh, little bubbles. So this should be fun for her. So I almost forgot to mention that with their Easter uh, umbrellas, I keep wanting to say baskets, with their Easter umbrellas that are going to be on top of it is this cute little bunny rabbit. I'm going to buy some like little balls. So they can have like a little game they're gonna throw it in there so i'm gonna make each a little bunny box so this should be cute and it should be fun for them to find outside um i'm hoping like i said that easter is nice enough that their stuff can be outside so this will be fun little thing for them to find while they're looking for their eggs they'll be able to look for their easter baskets as well um so yeah that's all i have for what's in my kids Easter umbrellas and if you want to see what their little Easter eggs what's going to be inside those please give this a like or comment down below and I hope to hear from you guys soon bye guys